Welcome to Autodesk Inventor Beginner Series Lesson 1. I am sure you are ready to get started drawing parts in Autodesk Inventor, but before we do that, there's one little thing we need to take care of first. It will really help in the long run if we set up a project that will help us store and organize our files. It might not seem like a big deal at first, but in the long run, as you do more work and create more files, it will really help to have them organized in projects. Now, if you notice right here, we have our default Inventor project. If you have a new installation of Inventor, then that's all that is there to start with. If you are using an existing installation, then there's probably some projects there to start with if this is a computer that somebody else has been using. But we want to create our own project file. So let's go over here and click on these three dots and then click on settings. Uh, you can see here this list is completely blank other than default. Uh, that's where all of the other projects would be stored. Let's create a new project. Click on new. A single user project is good for now. Click next. Uh, now this is the current path, but let's give it a location that'll be easy to find for right now. I'm just gonna put this on the desktop. We'll say make new folder. When new folder pops up, going to call this one beginner lessons and we say okay now we are on our desktop and beginner lessons let's also name the project beginner lessons uh, with that we can click finish notice that beginner lessons is now selected here in this window default is also there you change projects just by double clicking back and forth uh, so beginner lessons is selected and we say done. Now we have beginner lessons and default over here on this drop down. Now before we get started drawing our first part there's one more thing that you need to know and that is what happens if your project disappears from this list. I went in and deleted that project so now we are back to default again. Go back to projects and settings and here again we just have default. How do we go back and find that project that we created if something happens or if it gets taken away from this list? We simply come down to Browse at the bottom. Notice we are somewhere deep in the file system. We know we put that on the desktop, so I'm just going to click up arrow till we get all the way to the desktop. Now there is our Beginner Lessons folder, so we can double click it there. We come over here and click Open. And back in that folder is this little IPJ, the Inventor Project File. Again, double click or click open, and it is back on our list. That's it for lesson one. Click done, and we are ready to move on to lesson two and start drawing our first part.